Asa, peoples of the universe, welcome back to another little Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Play episode day. And in today's episode, well, the Duelist Cup thing is here. So we're gonna just hop into this and just play this. Um, so what I'm thinking I want to do is when there's events like this up, honestly, I might just play some duels off cam. Just because, like, realistically, I only do like an hour a day. So when it's like events like this in the future, well, for now and in the future, I might just play a couple off cam just to, you know, grind up a bit. And any good duels, I obviously should let you guys know, you know, go ahead and share. But yeah. So if I put a dude, let's just get straight in here, you know. Uh, if you guys didn't know, I also have like uh, two other accounts. I have my PC account and I have my iPad account. I'm currently dual level, dual level like 13, 14 on my PC account, and I think like 9 or 8 on my uh, iPad, so. I think between all of my accounts, this account is probably the weakest. <laughs> That's mostly due to, you know, time spent. I'm honestly, I play a lot, just you guys won't get to see it because, you know. If I ever figure out how to record on my uh laptop then you'll start seeing pc gameplay as well which is a lot more smoother than the console version so but you know we'll figure it out anyway let's see what we got let's see what we got let's see what we got our hands not bad we could do some of this hand t-shape um i think we start with stratos I think we start with Stratos here. Yeah. Let's see what he does. Will he negate me? Mm -hmm. No Ash Blossom. Nice. Mm -hmm. Now let's see. I think we won't get adjusted gold, but... Yeah, let's get adjusted gold. I know I'm kind of locking myself for a second, but it's fine. We're going to use adjusted gold's ability. He has a response, but he's not using the response. And I don't like that he's not using whatever his response is. It's probably Ash Blossom. Let's be real. Now we're going to use a reinforcement of the army. With our current hand, we might just go into like Trinity or something. Because I could fuse uh, Mist and still get Mist's ability. Uh, yeah, when it sends to the grave, I can still get a hero, which will obviously be like probably Honest Neos. Hmm. I think, I think that's what I want to do. Mm -hmm. And worst case, if he destroys it, I could just, you know, dark calling. So, um, let's poly. Let's see what uh, 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 let's see what happens here. Let's see what happens here. Dude. Actually, I could go into sunrise, can't I? Hmm. Mm, yeah, let's get Sunrise instead. Change of mind here. We're still going to use Mist and... Wait a second. Yeah, we'll use Mist and... Oh, damn, I can't do that. Shit. <laughs> Cause we did, we need to get rid of uh increase. But I don't really want to summon Trinity. I don't want to summon Trinity. I have to summon. I, no, we just have to do this. It's fine. Increase and Stratos. 
This will get us male confusion. Potentially. If he does negate something, I'm just gonna, uh, a hero lives. Now we're not gonna do anything else. We're just gonna go ahead and attack. Mm -hmm. This actually might be blue ass. No. But that is mildly annoying. Uh, I guess that's it for now. <laughs> that's mildly annoying. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Mm. Anytime I see someone drop face downs first, I kind of assume they don't have much to do for that time. Yeah. Okay. Come on, Hobby's Fire Duster. Mass change. This isn't a bad draw. Actually. Normal summon mist. Do, 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 do. Alright. Now I could, but we're not going to do that. We are going to, we're going to mass change mist into Dark Law. But we're going to first. Can't I? Uh, yeah, I can. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to attack with Mist, which should proc Sunrise's effect. And then we're going to pop his face down that he just dropped. We're going to pop this guy. Mm -hmm. Call it Haunted. Okay. No, we're not going to use it. Yep. Now we will use Sunrise to attack it. And then we're going to Mass Change into Dark Law. Which will also give us a hero. Mm -mm 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 Alright, now we mass change. Do, do. I hate the delay that you have on this. It's so annoying. That's probably the biggest flaw with a console version of um, Master Duel. It's just the delay is annoying. Dark Law! Do, 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 do. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yep. ability activates. And we're going to grab ourselves probably, I don't know. I'm thinking Honest Neos. Honestly. I'm thinking Honest Neos. <laughs> I could get Ferris, but we don't have any targets in our hand currently to even discard. I could do Vylon. Actually, doing Vylon probably be best. No, actually no. <clears throat> I think we do Ferris. No, no, no. I'm gonna go with my gut. It's telling me grab on his knees. We're gonna grab on his knees. Do 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 do. Now watch. He has like another starter's axi long thing here. Nope. What's you? If you control the junk monster, you can summon this god. Okay. Okay, so you're definitely using some kind of synchro deck. Okay, well. He's using an interesting deck. Maybe way it can't be destroyed by battle this time. Very interesting deck. I wonder if he's using like the starter deck, but like. Maybe added some cards to it or something. I don't know. Do, 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 do. I feel like he saved that monster, potentially because he doesn't have anything else in his hand. But we'll see. That's a big ass deck, though. 
55 card deck. Three, no, 56 card deck. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What does it do? Uh, can I be blah, blah, blah. When you draw this card, you feel some of ability. Um, it's a tune, though. Uh, well, it's a tune. Uh, it's a tune. Uh, well, realistically, he's probably not going to be special summoning a majestic monster, right? Like, I highly, well, I mean, I can't say I highly doubt it, but I don't imagine he's going to be synchro summoning for a majestic. There could be majestic monsters I don't know about, though. I only know, like, majestic shooting star dragon. And I know there's a, at least I'm pretty sure there's a red dragon offspring version of one. But I don't remember what it's called, so... I'm fairly certain he's not going to be knowing that. Then again, I guess he does have Link material. But I'd rather save this for when he's like mid-play, trying to search something or something like that, so... Yeah, yeah, see. Realistically, what he just did was just uh, add a monster to the field, really. <laughs> also, that little freezing thing apparently happens to everyone, so. Um. See, I could Dark Calling now, but it's gonna use one of the monsters. Well, it's gonna use Dark Law. It's gonna use Dark Law because I'm pretty sure Bane needs a Dark Monster, right? No, it's just level 5 or higher, so. Yeah, I mean, I could use Sunrise, but I don't wanna do that. We'll just play it out. <laughs> we do still control the hero monster, so that means Sunrise's ability will allow us to pop, pop, pop. Goodbye. Do 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 Yep. And the thing is, because of Dark Law, if he tries to add a card to his hand, um. It gets banished. Well, he loses one random card in his hand. So. He's screwed in that department as well. <laughs> screwed in that department too. Now we got a Solemn Judgment. Realistically, I don't think he has any plays left, but, you know. He can make a comeback. Quantum Pa. Quan, Quan Pa. What you got? What you got? What you got for me? What you gonna do? What you What you gonna do? What you What you gonna do? Yeah, you see a little like icon pops up. The console ports are just bad, bro. It's crazy. <laughs> What you gonna do? What you what you gonna do? Does Xbox have um Master Duel? I don't hear about Xbox players. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I know one of those face downs is like bait, so I mean it's possible both of them are bait, but Either way, thanks to Sunrise, we're gonna pop one, so. Do, 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 do. Alright, let's get it. Dark Claw. Sunrise effect. Mm. Let's go with this one this time. Well, Boku. Yeah, no. Mm. Gotta pay so much life points, but no, I am not letting you live another turn. And what was your face down? It was bait. Boy, it was running alive. Yeah, I think he's using some kind of uh, starter deck. I'm not sure how the matchmaking works in Master Duel, but I feel like because I don't play this, or because I haven't been playing on this account, I feel like I'm like in lower echelons. 
of like the matchmaking or something and just giving me kind of like new players and stuff. I'm not sure how the matchmaking works though. Well, I am Duelist level 1 going to 2 now, so yeah, that might be the case. That might be the case. Alright, let's go again. We'll see though. I mean, there'll be like god tier decks over in bronze sometimes. I mean, silver sometimes. I mean, you know. The thing is, my hero deck isn't even that great. There's things I want to add to it to make it like a little bit better. But heroes in general just isn't that great of a deck. But there's a couple things I want to add to it to make it better. Like I want to add more hand traps. Mostly I just want to add like at least two maxis. Um, two maxis. I want to add... I think one more Ash Blossom, because I think this deck only has one Ash Blossom. I want to have like two Ash, two Maxis, maybe two Effect Veilers. Well, I don't really need Effect Veilers. I, I don't think we care about Effect Veilers. But, never mind that. There's a couple things I want to do to this deck, and that's all that needs to be known, you know? I'm still going to make Black Wings, though. My Black Wings deck, I'm thinking... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to do that. I don't know how I'm going to do that yet. No clue. Ooh. Delonites. You didn't do anything? How big is your extra deck? How big is the extra deck? 11? Okay. Um. Well. Obviously. Oh, I know. I know. Ooh. This, yeah, we got a good hand here. Okay. So adjust the goals effect to get ourselves a dog calling. Oh no no no! Not that. Um, actually, I think we have game here. I think we literally just win. I can rakeki him. Actually, mm, nah, that's fine. Yeah, I think we have game. I think we win here. We use Ferris ability. Discard malicious. Special Summon Ferris. And then Ferris ability activates, which gives us an increase. Then we use increase ability to try to be Ferris to summon a Vylon. Then we use Vylon's ability. <laughs> it's a very standard combo. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Special Summon increase. Increase ability. Special summon. Okay. I guess. Oh, connection failed. I mean, he probably just closed the application. <laughs> yeah, he probably just closed the application, let's be honest. Alright, if we win this duel, um, we might call it for the episode. We'll see what time it is. Like, if we're not even at 20 minutes left, we're going to do one more, but we'll see. But yeah, now nah, I'm going to do some duels off cam just to make it a little bit more interesting. Like between last episode and this one is like, you know, wasn't that intriguing. Like, sure, it's cool that I'm winning, but like, I would like to have a kind of a challenge. Like, see, we got one maxi in this deck. I don't think I have two, though. Okay. He did nothing. 15 card extra deck, 40 card deck, okay. It might be a kaiju player. Mm -hmm. Alright. I don't know how I want to do this. I think. Because this will let me get Miss in the Grave, add a hero, like add like Vylon or something. Not Vylon, Ferris, but. Okay, I think I know what our move here is. We summon Stratos, add a hero, Ash Blossom, Max C, huh? 
All right. Actually, no. We can ask Blossom that. F yo, Maxi. No, Maxi. <laughs> I was gonna say okay, we're just gonna hit him for eighteen hundred and fast, but never mind. We got ourselves a little bit of, uh, you know. See, I don't feel good about getting Ferris and discarding Vylon because Vylon's effect can be useful, but I feel like this is more, uh, like this makes more sense, you know. This makes more sense. No. Mm -mm -mm. Cause this will give us increase, and then we can get the combo started. Increase into Vylon, blah blah blah. You know the drill. Oh wait, what if he has um, Nib? What if he has Nibiru? That would be not good. We get Ferris in the graveyard because we want him in there for adjusted gold. Mm -hmm. Alright, Vylon's ability activates. Now we send Mist. No. Don't do whatever you're thinking of doing. You. Okay. That sucks. That actually sucks a lot. That that sucks a lot. <laughs> I think Crusader only told some of his Destiny heroes. Some <laughs> Destiny hero monsters in your grave. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. I mean... Yeah, that sucks. That, that sucks. Alright, well. We told you to attack then. <laughs> that sucks. That really do sucks. That actually really hurt. M stopping increases effect really hot. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Part of me feels like I should still summon Crusader, but at the same time, I don't think that's the move. Like, I wouldn't even be able to do anything with this. And he'll be lower attack than Stratos. Nah, we'll just pass for ton and hope. <laughs> um, I don't think I'm gonna set evenly match. I'm gonna keep it in the hand. Evenly match is such a good card. I don't know why people don't run it more often. In the battle phase, if your opponent controls more cards than you do, you can make your opponent banish cards from their field face down if they control the same amount of cards as you do. And then, if you control no cards, you can have this card from your hand. So in the event that he has like Harvey Feather Duster, Rikeki, I will just go into battle phase next turn, end it immediately just to make him banish whatever he does. Assuming we live that long. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm so oh boy he I'm not sure if you guys remember but like way back when I started doing these let's plays for the Yu-Gi-Oh I mentioned that if you want to disrupt a Yu-Gi-Oh play or a hero player stop increase because stopping increase oh boy that's like that's killer that's killer that hurts stopping increase that's that's bad. Call by the grave. This would have been useful like a ton ago to stop his ass blossom. But you know, it's fine. It's not fine, but you know. Damn, I still. Uh, mm, actually, I could do Predator Plant. I could do. Pre I, I think I have to do Predator Plant. There ain't no damn. I could do. I have to do Predator Plant. <laughs> this is my only play. This is literally my only play here. Do 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 do. Use his effect. Pay a crispy 2k. 
2K. Grab ourselves a fusion destiny. Mm, mm, mm. I would have been sick if he had another. Dangerous. Um, I keep calling him dangerous. Uh, send a malicious. And we will send you. Yeah, you. All right. Now, what I could do is destroy this. This is destroy that, just so I don't have to worry about. What, actually, no, that, that is what I want to do. I don't want to find out what his face down is. <laughs> Actually, wait a second. Fusion Destiny, I could attack on the same time, right? Yeah, just destroy it on your face, that's fine. Uh, uh, goodbye to you. So we definitely want to keep the face now. And goodbye to that. Dragon Maid, okay. So that's what we're dealing with now. We're dealing with Dragon Maids. We're dealing with Dragon Maids, but apparently he done bricked. <laughs> <laughs> the best thing about running um, DPE in this deck is the fact that it's actually a hero deck. So its effect of, you know, in decreasing your opponent's attack per hero call you have in your grave it actually does something. <laughs> best part about it. Literally the best part about it. Also, if you guys wonder why I'm not running Celestial, it's mostly because this isn't a Destiny Hero deck. It's not Destiny Hero deck. Sure, Celestial, you know, allowed me to draw two cards if I had no cards in my hand, which happens frequently. But I would have to banish stuff in the grave, like a Celestial plus something else. And uh, realistically, I don't. There's not many Destiny Heroes that I want banished. Ooh. Hmm. He sent a spell, so I can't use a spell. I mean... The effects are negated, right? The attackers have the effects are negated. I mean, that's probably fine. I think that's fine. Whatever. I think that's fine. Because even if he destroyed it, I could just special summon it back. So, like here, like, I could just use his effect now. Right? I don't think it negates in the graveyard. Yeah, it doesn't negate in the graveyard. Mm -hmm. Another forbidden chalice. Bring on DPE back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now I think I can put some denial, can I? Uh, over here. Uh, you can special summon this card from your grave. You're going. Wait. One more time, you have a Destiny Hero monster on your field or in the grave. Other than, yeah, I can summon it. Yeah. So, we're going to go ahead and just do a little bit of this. I can special summon malicious too, but we're not going to do malicious. We're just going to end it like this. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? Uh, you can take one Destiny Hero monster from your deck, or you can ban it place on top of your deck. Oh. Oh! That's kind of good. I keep on saying this, like, every time, like, when I put him in this deck, right, I read his effect, and I was like, oh, I could use that! And then every time I use it, it's like, oh shit, it does that? <laughs> like, I keep forgetting what his effect is. I'm gonna be honest, I might take him out. 
like he's not bad. I could just get like a quick boss on the field, but I don't really know when his effect would come in clutch for me. I mean, I guess maybe for plasma, but then I have to have three monsters already on the field or something. I don't know. Maybe I'll come in some niche situation later down the line. All right, let's see how long this video's been going on for. Oh, it's been 30 minutes. Okay, well then, then yeah, that will be it for this video. Thanks for watching. I will catch you guys in the next one. Uh, how many gems we got? 2k. Hmm. When we get 3k more gems, we shall do more pulls. And I think when we get 3k more gems, we're going... Actually, yeah. When we get 3k more gems, we're going to make a deck. We're going to make our Blackwing deck. Then, depending if we need cards or not, we will make a deck. I mean, we will do pulls the following day. But yeah. That's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoy. And as always, take care and peace. Bye bye. Actually, do I only say that only? Was that the main channel thing? I don't even know. Either way, take care. Bye. <laughs>